all right y'all so this is fresh from right underneath the dryer as you can see we have some juicy juicy curls and let me do a 360 hold on let me turn on some more light all right let's zoom in on the curls y'all because this is what it's about so all right so i decided to do a week in my wash and go so today is day i don't know see this is why I get confused. So if I do my hair in the morning and I wear it for that day, is that day one or is the next day day one? So depending on how you count, this could either be day two or day one. But I did get a full day wear out of my wash and go yesterday. So I would count that as my day one. So this is my day two. We still have curls. It's fully dry now, but it's still really soft. And let me turn around. So the hair is holding up pretty good and I'll also do a clip of what it looks like in the sun because I just feel like <clears throat> the camera is really not doing it justice and maybe it's my lighting so let's turn on some more lights but this is day two not very far off from day one yes we have some shrinkage but the hair is still really soft but the curls are still there so I want to say we'll debunk something just because you don't use three different gels doesn't mean your wash and go can't last. But the point of a wash and go is for the health of the hair. So if your hair is not hydrated enough to go 14 days, don't go 14 days. Because that's no different than you putting your hair in a protective style, i.e. braids, leaving it in for a couple of months and your hair get damaged. So if we're talking about health, you're going to do what your hair can do. So I know my hair right now can go a week because I deep condition. So my hair will be perfectly fine going this week. So I did my hair on Saturday, today is Sunday, and I'll probably redo my hair Thursday morning. So I'm gonna go five days. I'm not going the full seven days because I have training coming up and I'm gonna want to redo my hair because Savannah is quite humid quite humid so I'll show you like if you want a little bit of firmness but not like crunchy hard firm what I'm gonna do to kind of make it work to fit that um, climate because again Savannah is humid ie there's a lot of moisture and water in the air and my hair gonna be like Dang. yeah so we'll come back on day three and I'll show you what my hair is looking like love it the shape is shaping because we do know now you can cut hair straight and it does translate curly. All right. Bye. <clears throat> Good morning. This is day three. Yeah, day three. I have two more days of my wash and go. So I just want to show y'all real quick in the morning what I do not a lot of heat i just and it has the the attachment on there i blow it and and that's about it i may do a little you know juju in but yeah so do i think this is gonna last two more days i think so but we'll be back tomorrow talk when you get ready for work we are at the end of day three I just want to come back and show you with this camera. Looking good.
All right, so whew, today is going to be the last day of wear. Again, this is just like a little neck that I use to sleep in sometimes, depending on how hot I feel. And we just going to fluff. Hold on, let me switch hands. We going to fluff. I just want to say I do not use a blow dryer every morning to kind of fluff it out. Maybe that initial first time, and, and that is like rare. Okay, we do we still got a part? A little bit. A little bit. And so this is what the hair is looking like. Very soft. We have quite a bit of volume. And no, I have not picked out my hair. I don't know if I can turn around. Oh, let me let me sit y'all right here. Let's see if I can turn around. You can see me. Okay, so hopefully you was able to see that. See the back of my head, but this is what we're looking like. Mm -hmm. The color is coloring. I went for a cowboy copper. I didn't want anything light because I don't plan to maintain this color multiple times a year. Max two, max three. Okay, max three. But I won't be coloring it for a while. And here we are. It's time for me to go to work. <clears throat> Thank you. So again, this is day because I did this Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. This is day five. Come tomorrow, I will end up redoing it. Do I have to redo it tomorrow? No, but I'm about to go to military training. So therefore, I do want to redo this because once I get there, I'm not going to have the will or the desire to redo my hair. And I want to stay with my regiment of deep conditioning weekly so my hair can maintain this softness that it has developed into. So thank you for tuning in. And yes, I have several black shirts. You ain't ass, but I'm going to tell you. All right. So today is the last day before I wash my hair. Well, I'm washing my hair today. And you see how much it shrunk up? It's because my hair is healthy. Healthy hair shrinks. And I'll go out with no shrinkage. But you can see there's some curls somewhere up in here in a few places. But it's definitely time for me to redo my hair. Because I have military training, I'm going to wash, condition, deep condition. Well, deep condition, then condition. And I'm probably gonna put my hair in like two braids. Yep. I'm not doing a wash and go. No. I'm gonna probably put my hair in two braids and call it a day. But I just wanted to show you this is day six. Day six. Today is day six. And I'm happy. Sometimes y'all think wash and go's gotta last two months. No, they don't. Okay. They don't. Some people here can last for two weeks. That's beautiful. Some people here can last for a week. Beautiful. Some people here last two or three days. To that, I say, God dang. That's this style ain't for you. Okay. This ain't for you. It's, it's barely for me. And we have learned from watching um, African Hair God and Henny. They did a live that, you know, washing goes primarily when washing goes may not be the healthiest for us curly, coily girls, whatever you want to consider yourself. So it was fun. I'll bring this back out in a few weeks. We have some, some, just a little bit of flakes. I don't know if you can see. It's just, just, just a little sprinkle. But yeah, that's it. Bye.